My name is George Good, and I'm from Raytown, Missouri. I arrived at Louisville on, in July 2007, during the summer. It was, it was a fun experience being there uh, for four years. I learned a lot about basketball. I learned a lot from Coach Patino. George was going to become a graduate student, already graduating from Louisville and looking for a place to play for his last year. FDU was looking for somebody to play in my position, and he think that I would fit the best. I already have my communications degree. It was more than just basketball for George. He wanted to go to a place that had sports administration, the major that he's doing in graduate school now. He wanted to be in a big city. George is, is very bright. Uh, he, does a, you know, he, he knows a lot about the game. He, he did a lot of research on schools. He wanted to go to a conference where he felt like he could play immediately. And you see, it, it surprised me because coming from the Big East, I didn't know what to expect from the NEC. The NEC has a lot of good players and uh, I have a lot of respect for it. Every team that we play against has defensive schemes against them. And for him to still have this production, I think it makes him probably the best big man to me in the league. Going back to Louisville, was, it was fun. I enjoyed it a lot. When you look at Louisville and you look at Coach Patino, you, you see class. Playing against them, it was a lot of fun. It reminded me a lot of practice, except for I had a different jersey on. Before the game, the way Coach Patino treated us, treated George, and he gets announced and they give him a standing ovation. He comes out of, out of the game after having a great game. They they're standing ovation because it was one of their own. And um, I think that's all Coach Patino and the class he brings to Louisville. And the way those people uh, responded to George Good at the end of that game when he walked off the court, I, I seriously got chills and I've been in the game a long time. I think it meant a lot to his family for him to go back there and get the response that he got. You know, it showed that even though he left Louisville, he would still always be a Cardinal. That, that was a great moment for his family. Having a guy like George, he came in with like a 3-2 GPA from Louisville, graduated, he has a 3-3 now in grad school. So it's refreshing that you don't have to worry about the guys in the classroom. And with George especially, you don't have to worry about anything off the court. He's such a mature person, handles his business, and he's just been a pleasure to have around.